Excavator Types and Their Application on the Construction Site Part 2 The bucket is raised and lowered by the hoist rope, while the bucket is pulled toward the driver by the drag line. Drag lines are frequently assembled on site due to their weight. This excavator's innovative technique is widely utilized in large-scale civil engineering projects like canal dredging. Suction Excavators These excavators, sometimes known as vacuum excavators, have a suction pipe capable of sucking up to 400 horsepower of air. To loosen the earth, the excavator uses a water jet. The pipe's sharp teeth at the edge produce a vacuum that pulls soil and debris away at speeds of up to 200 miles per hour. A suction excavator is perfect for sensitive subsurface applications because it reduces the risk of damage by more than half. Skid Steer Excavators Skid steers have brooms and buckets that face away from the driver, unlike ordinary excavators. Because the attachments are oriented this way, they may reach over the cab rather than around it, making them useful in tighter spaces and tighter turns. When space is restricted and objects are spread out, they are frequently employed for digging pools, site cleaning, domestic chores, and debris disposal. Long Reach Excavators A long reach excavator has a longer arm and boom section, as the name implies. The design makes it easier to operate in difficult to reach areas. The excavator's extendable arm has a horizontal reach of nearly 100 feet. These excavators are perfect for demolition activities such as structural crumpling and wall demolition, as well as applications that demand working in wet environments. The arm can be fitted with various attachments to accomplish additional tasks such as shearing, crushing, and cutting. For more information call 214-773-0207 or visit celliarconstructionequipment.com.